Hello Youtubers, I'm Parwais and this is our 21st video in QD5 C++ GUI application development. Uh, in the previous video we have learned how you can control your animations using QE Sync Curve. So in this video we are going to uh, continue our animation topic and in this video I want to show you how you can create animation groups in QD5 C++. Uh, basically, there are two kinds of animation group uh, in QD5 C++. Uh, we have a Q parallel animation group. Also, we have a Q sequential animation group. So, I will make separate videos for these two animation group. Uh, particularly in this video, we are going to talk and make an example for a parallel animation group. So I'm going to create a new file or project, Qt widget application, choose, you can give it a name. I name it uh, Q Parallel Animation Group and click on next, next, uh, Q main window, next finish. Okay, now we have our files of project. We have a main window.h, main .cpp, and main window.cpp. So in the main window.h, I'm going to add uh, some classes. Uh, first, I'm going to include a Q property animation. If you don't know about Q property animation, you can watch the previous videos. Also, I'm going to add a Q parallel animation group. So now I'm going to create these in here pointer to this uh, Q property animation I call it uh, animation one because it is a, a animation group so I'm going to create uh, three uh, property animation uh, I call it animation two and also Q property animation I call it animation three Okay, now these are our three animations. After this, I'm going to create a Q parallel animation, Q parallel animation group, and I'm going to call it animation group like this. So, after this, open your main window.cpp and in the constructor, first you need to create uh, three. Uh, okay, before this, I'm going to open my window.ui and I'm going to add three push buttons uh, one first one and the second one and the third one like this okay uh, now if you check uh, the uh, object name uh, you can see it is push button 3 it's push button 2 and it is push button now open your main window.cpp and in the constructor I'm going to create uh, animation 1 new Q property animation now in the in here uh, you can add your first push button UI uh, push button 1 and also add a geometry uh, a geometry in here okay uh, after this I'm going to set the duration of my animation uh, animation 1 uh, set duration and I want to give it uh, 3000 milliseconds and also animation 1 set start value I'm going to set the start value to the push button itself UI push button uh, geometry okay and at the end I'm going to add as end value animation 1 end value and I want a correct for the end value uh, 50 200 150 okay if now I start my animation uh, you will see I have one button and it is uh, uh, animating uh, let me run this basically this was from the previous video and uh, I want to just show you the animation and you can watch the previous videos for this now it's going uh, uh, QN volume function does not take one argument uh, Q rect 
set oh sorry it's set and volume it is uh, I have make mistake in here I have made okay set and volume okay uh, after this run your application now it's going to be built and uh, it take some time for the first yeah. now we have a uh, uh, first animation for our for our button after this I'm going to create these animation for my uh, uh, two uh, remaining buttons so I'm going to just copy this uh, I don't want to write these because I have write it once uh, now this is animation 2 animation 2 animation 2 and animation 2 and you need to just change this to push button 2 and also you need to change this to 150 okay and also push button 2 now just copy this and add this for your <coughs> animation tree animation tree animation tree animation tree and change this to push button tree and also push button tree make it 250 okay after this now we have created our three animations uh, this was not our topic because before this we have learned about creating animations uh, now we are going to create our animation group uh, because uh, we need a parallel animation uh, so I'm going to create my animation group in here let me come in this uh, create parallel animation group now uh, animation group new uh, Q parallel animation group after this now we are going to add animation we are going to add our these three animations to our animation group uh, animation group add animation animation one animation group add animation animation 2 and animation group add animation animation 3 okay after this we are going to start our animation group animation group start okay now I'm going to run this hopefully uh, we don't get any error and this was our complete code you can check it once again it's just simple we have three uh, buttons yeah you can see now these are our parallel uh, when we run this all of them are in parallel uh, so for the uh, sequential uh, we will make another video if you have any question please let me know and for the further videos don't forget subscription and also like the videos